We have had enough of this governor's bullying of our public school teachers, and I am not going to let it continue. Attorney General Andy Bashir filed the lawsuit 10 days after asking the Labor Cabinet to rescind its subpoenas. He says the right of teachers to protest is protected by case law after a similar lawsuit in Michigan. And they said as long as teachers in a sick out are protesting um, overall funding for public education or issues related to the public education system in general, that it is protected First Amendment speech. Bevan fired back at Bashir. It's remarkable to me how incompetent how corrupt, how remarkably unwilling to do his job our attorney general is. Bevan insists the labor cabinet is within its right to investigate teachers, and he attacked Bashir's motives. It's 100% to do with politics. It's 100% to do with getting him elected. There is no mention in this lawsuit whatsoever of the free speech rights of any of these people at stake. Not one word, because that's not what it's about. He's a hypocrite. A review of the lawsuit found the phrase free speech 26 times. This is the same governor who locked people out of the Capitol who are here to protest and disagree with them. This is a governor who has used state resources uh, to bully people and to further his own political agenda and to attack political enemies almost every day of his administration. Next week, Bashir is going to ask a judge for an injunction to give the school districts a reprieve from the subpoena deadline. In Frankfurt, Mark Vandroff, WLKY News.